Hello everyone, I am Veos and welcome back to another video. Unfortunately, I have about 35 minutes of video that was corrupted. And yeah, that sucks. Son of a bitch. But anyway, I had the engineer go around the station and put around, uh, put on um, landing gears um, in order to move the station. Unfortunately, that didn't work. The station slid down a hill into a small little pit. And that is where we are starting off now. I have the vehicles that I've kind of placed around it to keep from sliding anymore. And the... Um, the plan here is to, uh, well, basically to undock everything and just try to get the lander back up to its original spot. So that's, that's what we're going to do. And now I will return you to the old me. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'm going to build something called a mover type B. And I was working on it just a second ago. It is a very heavy craft. Uh, I need some fuel for it, though. So we're going to have to fill up the fuel tanks for this one. All right, let's do this and load and... and... Hello? Build. Ho, ho, ho. This is going to be good. <clears throat> I see it's a little glitched in. I'm not too happy about that. I'm hoping it doesn't explode. Uh, make the string strength a little stronger here on the side. No? Damn. Well, I did make it heavier, so I'm sure that doesn't help. Okay, so I've lowered this side down, try to bring the other side up, and hopefully that works. If I can turn it, right? This button here turns it? Ay ay ay. Not really that much. I, I need like uh, an increments that like turns it a lot. Shit. Alright, here we are. First thing in the morning, let's just get a little bit of light on the subject here. Oh boy. Uh, F5 save. I, I see explosions in our future. Finalize. Oh, okay, we're gonna have to do this quick. Got fuel in it? No, it does not have fuel in it. Come on, man. Out, out, get out, get out, hurry. Oh, shit. Uh, she's drifting. All right, she's full. Undock. Oh, wow. Get control of your shit. Oh, my gosh. Wow. It took out <laughs> every single one. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Holy crap, it took out every single one? What in the world? Brakes are at 200, so why is it still spinning? Oh, I guess I wasn't paying attention. Wow, it just it just took everybody out. Son of a biscuit eater. <laughs> it just wiped everything out. Pop, 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 all the way down. Yeah, and for my next trick, Shit. Okay, rocket parts. Uh, we, we have enough rocket parts, right? I don't know. We're, we're, we're about to... Are not, I know our power is about to go out. This thing has internal power for fuel. Oh, wow. Start fuel cell wasn't even wasn't even on. Well, now that's a problem. Just one of them was on. I got it. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to fill up with metal and we're going to make sure we have enough rocket parts and we're going to ditch these on the side and I'm going to put wheels on this and I'm going to push it up the hill and we'll label these as junk and the computer will delete them. I found out... Some Someone pointed out that these right here are not relay capable. So that's nice. That being the case, um, we're going to have to start uh, slapping on relay dishes, that, which which also means that the satellites that we put in orbit are worthless. Yep. So that means that I am going to have to replace those satellites. So we can we can pretend, uh, and this is pretty cool because, you know, it's, it's a cheap colony ship that was thrown together at the last minute, trying to save as many lives as possible, but, you know, it, it's, it is not one. 100%. So I could imagine that those satellites were defective. Like there was some sort of software glitch that made them, that rendered them useless. Um, which, you know, could happen in a, an emergency situation where everything's rushed, right? So we're going to have to uh, launch uh, satellites that actually work in the future. Uh, that being the case, I'm going to have to have an engineer replace this with a actual relay antenna uh, so we can actually communicate with our robotic craft. This is robotic. This is robotic. That's piloted. So we're, we're good on that one. I'm actually going to take the uh, dish off of this one and put it on this one right here. As a matter of fact, let me do that now. So this truck does have a hitch to it, but unfortunately in this case, it, w it wasn't doing anything. Uh, operation in progress cannot detach. Oh, okay. Is it broken? Operation in progress cannot detach. Uh-huh. I think it's broken. I can't detach it. Mm-hmm. Which doesn't make any real sense. Come on, give me a highlight. Highlight it. Highlight it. Give me a... Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yay, you got it. Okay, so we're just going to put this on the side for now and we'll put the uh this uh i mean we could still probably use it 
Oh, excuse me. So I think I'm just going to put a lip on the back of the truck. No, can't do that. Huh, fascinating. Put it right there then. I'll just put this right back up here like it was. There, right there. Hello? Mm -hmm. <coughs> Okay, that's fine. All right, good. So I fixed the back of the truck. I had to weld it shut. Actually, we're running low on fuel. Ooh, I'm glad I took that. Um, took a look at that. Damn, I didn't realize we were so low on fuel. We got less than a half tank. Okay, so I'm going to actually take the truck's relay dish and put it on here. And I'm going to take this relay dish off because it sucks and it's worthless. So put that on there. Also going to take the air brakes off. Don't need those anymore. I mean, eventually I'm going to strip this thing down, but you know... It, it's it's not necessary just yet. Okay, so what we do need to do is grab some wheels and put it on the other side of the uh, craft. I'm going to grab these wheels and drop it right there for now. Doink rolling away. I'm going to grab it again. And I'm just going to put it right there for now. Climb over this. Did I just pop inside? What the shit? I did. I just popped inside here. That's not cool. Now I'm stuck? What the hell? Shit, just... So these are Kerbal Traps. Okay, good to know. Uh, the only way I can see out of this is to undock. Did it just redock? It did, didn't it? Undock. Don't you dare redock. Let me click on the poor trapped Kerbal. I have a plan. And it's to take this and and move it. Okay, shit. Uh, can I take that? I'll take a little strut. No, can't get to it, huh? Oh, no, no. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got another plan. It's to go to the show UI and release. Oh, come on. It didn't, ta okay, I think, I think we're good. I think we're good. I think it detached. I think it detached. All right? Okay, engineer, get yourself out. Open up the hatch, because you can do that now. Mm -hmm. Why is it I can take this, right? Oh, wow, I could, I, <laughs> but I can't, touch this this is so weird i'm i'm trapped what in the world i am trapped i'm literally trapped she's trapped in there okay this is uh this is weird okay huh <laughs> i don't know what to do <laughs> um hmm wow uh well hold on uh if i okay hold on uh, well, she can still she can still kind of do engineering in that spot. So let's let's finish this gear the best we can. Uh, put it uh, somewhere uh, down here. Okay. Ooh. Right. There's nothing on this side, but I'm kind of hoping that. Uh, yeah. 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 How far? Uh, hmm. Uh, <laughs> well. Shit. <laughs> um. Can I? Mm. Damn it. And there's no way for her to get inside because it's the ah uh, lord of mercy this is uh jeez i've never been in this position before that's what she said um huh all right well let's uh, robotically con control this and let's go ahead and disconnect this undock and make sure we release it show you why release this thing's really heavy oh whoa it's got a broken tire okay i think i think we'll be okay though it's really heavy with a lot of grip and a lot of power a lot of grip and a lot of power electric charge is good i don't even think we need this we've got this bad boy here generating electric charge fuel array fuel cell array okay we're just gonna have to leave her there for now sorry about that and uh, we're gonna put these gears up yeah i figured that's what that would, that would do that's okay we're gonna give her a good push and here we go oh wait is her brakes on Yes, it is. Give her a good push. Here we go. Oh, come on, man. You're you're stronger than this. Uh, it's scraping the ground, going uphill. So right there. Oh, damn. Damn it. Wish I could break this. I wish I could break that. Hmm. Everybody in orbit's like, hey, uh, we're running out of food, so you need to like, you know, speed things up. <laughs> I can just see it. We're running out of food, so just, you know, kind of speed things up a little bit. See, I could push the truck with its brakes on, no problem. So I know this thing's got some some oomph, but it needs a wheel on the other side, man. <sighs> so in the future, mm, no, I can't really. I don't know, man. There is no future. It is now. The now is now. The present is now. All right, we're going to do something else. We've, we've got a lot of fuel, right? It's like, Veos, you're crazy. Don't do it, Veos, you're crazy. F5 save. Veos, you're crazy. What are you doing? Veos, no. Oh, yes. We're doing this. T minus three, two, one. Huh. One side's heavier than the other. How'd that happen? Is it the metal and stuff? Perhaps? I, I don't know. So let's go ahead and try to counter that by putting our thrust to, uh, oh, say 86%. 80, let's go 85, 85. Okay, let's try that. See what happens. Oh, too much. All right, so let's bring it up to uh, 95. Try to balance it out here. 
Nope, still too much. Okay, so not 95. 90. I'm a survivalist, damn it. I'm like, I'm gonna I'm gonna MacGyver the fuck out of this. Alright, let's do this. Well, let's not crash into our stuff, right? Back it up, back it up, back it up. <laughs> and three, two, one. Oh wait. This is clear now. Maybe I can get another engineer out here. Oh, there's no one to drive this thing. Ew. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> Hold on. Come on, come on, touch it, touch it, touch it. Dock with it. You know you want to. Hello? You docking? Is anybody docking? Aim camera. Oh, you're so close. You're so close. All right, so I'm going to actually give it a little bit of gas. Ah, we docked with it. Cool. Sweet. Damn. Okay. Time is 5.55 a.m. I got a little couple more minutes. Transfer over to here. Hallelujah. EVA. I don't care about the parachute. Just get your engineering butt over here. <laughs> get over here and free me! I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, I can't even get you out there. Seriously? Huh. Alright, we're in range. Take that. Pop that right there. Uh, okay. We're gonna make this work, damn it. I am determined. Extend. Okay, we're gonna take this now and... Come on, give me something. Right there. Okay. Okay. Don't need these. I don't, I, I don't really have to detach them. I could, like, plop them on the ground, but, you know. Alright, wheels are on. Probably be able to push it this time. Still haven't figured out how to get the other engineer out of there. I mean, I'm obviously gonna get her out. Probably gonna destroy it or build a seat or something that she can flop out of. You know, put, put a seat on top so she can enter it, that kind of thing. Okay, let's hopefully not explode when we undock. Alright, get out of there quick. Hey, are you listening? Go, go, get out of there. Move. Hello. Okay, good, good, good. Alright, let's get the truck in position. Well, I, actually, at this point, uh, I just want this thing to roll away from all this. Hold on. If I rename vessel to junk, put X, or just name junk. Hello. Okay, and uh, is there a way to rename a vessel? Um, no. No, I may have goofed on this one. Crap. Okay, we'll figure it out. But if I rename that junk, and I disappear and come back. She'll just be there, right? She won't die. I know, it's six o'clock, thank you. Right? Sort of? Mm-hmm. All right, let's do this. Come on, I'm all out of time. Let's move this. Move, 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 move. Go, 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 go. Sass is on. All right. Okay, so it is rolling now. Oh, she's so top heavy. This thing could roll over. I'm very, 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 very afraid of it rolling over. Mr. Engineer, could you fix my tire real quick? Well, wait. Oh, well, no, no, we got, we got repair kits. Could you fix my tire real quick, please, on the double, before this thing rolls all over the place? Preferably. EVA requires two repair kits. No problem. Um, because I have repair kits. Wait, okay. I have the two repair kits on my person. Right. I've got two repair kits. Oh, oh, I just had to click it. Okay, cool. We're good. We're good. We're so good. Oh, this thing's going back and forth. Come on, do something. Thank you. All right, mover. Time to do your thing. Ah! <laughs> Move, bitch. Get out the way. <laughs> Give another ram. Another ram. And the engineer's inside there. Every time it rams, it's like, what the hell is going on? Boom. It's like, don't worry, we got you. Everything will be fine. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Boom. If I could break it, that'd be great. Problem is that these things are rated for like 50 impact or something like that. Some some wild thing I can't think off the top of my head, but it's definitely more than what this little guy can muster in one hit. Back up a little bit wider here. Full power. Let's do this. Uh, uh, here we go. Seven meters per second. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Uh. Oh shit. Sorry. Jeez. Oh shit. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no! Uh, land on your feet! Oh, you lucky truck! Oh, you lucky truck! <laughs> oh, that's that's gotta be a Toyota. Okay, everything's moved out of the way, but I am all out of time for today. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much for being a part of this channel. I am Veos. Love you all. Take care, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now. Bye-bye. Oh, this is going to be rich. Huh. Truck's fine. It's good. It's all good.